Welcome back to May I, Day 12. Well, I just want to talk about what happened with the video earlier that I posted earlier today, Day 11. I'm going to be making a change in my lifestyle. I'm going to get healthier, fit. So, may I change my lifestyle? May I get fit? And these are some encouraging advice that's been happening. This is from Edwin. This is Brian. He has asthma induced by allergies and physical activity. Brian came in for a session with me to see how he would like the training. He told me afterwards that he was ready to get healthy and that he wanted to sign up. This morning, our group had a great workout and afterwards, I set up a course for each of them to run. There was a privilege moment in Brian's run that blew us all away and moved us all. He went down an obstacle that was very similar to a zip line. It took him a bit to find the grip to be able to go down, but he got it. It was at that moment he was complete the drop, and all of us saw a spark go off in Brian. He was confidence changed, and he flew through the course eagerly to prove himself that he can do it. After he finished the course, he came up to me and explained that was going down. The slider drop obstacle brought him back to an accident he had on a zip line. He had fallen from heights and he never wanted to try it again. The zip line. He had fell, fallen from height and even wanted to try it again. I was very moved by this because even though the obstacle wasn't high off the ground, he still had the fear in him from his accident and he trusted me to help him. Brian set the bar high today and he was amazed example of coming into anything with an open mind and having no excuse. He, he never said, I can't do this. He has given everything his best shot, even if he didn't make it because he knew that he would push himself to get there eventually. He conquered a fear today, and he started a new journey to healthier lifestyle. Thank you, Brian, and a special thanks to Longbow, Mel, and Tank for showing support. This was from Horseback Rider and Light. So proud of you for wanting to get healthier and start working out. That's awesome. This is what some people have said so far. Way to go. Well done, Brian. Stay with the course. Very proud of you, Brian. Good job, man. Keep it up. You only get better and feel more confident the more you push through it. Great job, Brian. Just wanted to let you know I'm pulling for you. I'm proud of your accomplishments and motivation to continue regardless, regardless your fears. Keep up the great job. Edwin will get you healthier mind, body, and soul. Best wishes. From Alex W. Young. Nice job, Brian. From Robin. Good job, Bri. Way to go, Brian. Yeah, kid. Awesome. Way to go. I watched the video. Wow, Brian, I'm very impressed. Keep it up, Brian. You go, Red Knight. Good job, man. Keep up the good work. If you need any help, let me know. Good for you, Brian. Keep going. You are inspiration to all of us to get moving. Thank you all for helping me get through this. Our transmission is being interfered again. Hello, Red Knight. I got something here you like. A bag of crab chips. How about eat some now? Cause you won't be able to get very far. <laughs> nah, I don't need any crab chips. Got a nice fresh bottle of water here. So. 
Drink this up. What is the most healthiest thing to drink? And I like to thank everybody who's gonna help me go through this lifestyle change. I like to thank my co-workers, which <clears throat> I'm not allowed to mention any of their names. I like to thank Edwin to help me going to go through this. I like to thank my friends. Robin, Alex, and a special thanks to the tank, Longbow, and Mel. And thank you all for commenting, getting my spirits up to go through this. And I'd like to thank the Lord, Jesus. And that's all for today. See you all next time on May I. I'm your host, The Red Knight.